Yo, my name is Zosh. Yo, it's Young Static. What's cracking, guys? This is Christian from Honda Vlogs. Yo, 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 vatos locos. This is Vasile Garage. And you know who you're watching? You're watching Lazy Man Garage. You're watching Lazy Man Garage. And you're watching Lazy Man's Garage. Lazy Man Garage. Welcome back to another video of part two of the paint job that's going to be happening to this RSX. Uh, so last night I thought I sanded the whole car. I was pretty happy about myself. I was like, hmm, I sanded the whole car. Good. You know, I can sleep good night tonight. Wake up, come outside. Since it's, the car is silver, you couldn't really see last night. So now that I look and I see that the car isn't fully sanded as I thought it would be. So now I got to go back and sand a lot more than I thought. So what I did was I took some water, wet the car, and, uh, I saw a lot of spots that I missed, so I was like, great. Still haven't gotten this area yet because I'm waiting on Alex to show up to take off the side skirt so I could do that. Because if I do it, I'm going to fuck it up. So I've got all my markings here, like I said yesterday. And I'm actually going to fill those in with Bondo. Well, not Bondo, but uh, spotting glaze because they're not so deep. Uh, the one that might need it is that one right there. But the, all these right here aren't that deep, so I might not even have to use... Uh, Bondo but spotting glaze itself so uh, I'm gonna get to that after this and I'm gonna do that okay so I got the uh, um... <laughs> so I got the rear bumper off with the taillights because that's gonna get painted and I want the whole thing to get painted um, so I got the taillights out so that way I don't have to tape anything pretty much it's just easier that way um, I don't think he'll really care if after uh, uh, overspray gets on the frame of the car, but man, is this this thing is look, starting to look like a shell? It's starting to look like a fucking part out. Next, these got to come off. Alex, where are you? I need your fucking help. I already took off these. Uh, took off the front bumper, the tail lights, the hood. I mean, not the hood. The front bumper, the front tail uh, headlights, the rear tail lights, the rear bumper, the fenders. The weather stripping on top, and uh, that's it for right now. So I'm gonna start. Oh, I took off one mirror, and I gotta take off the other one because that was broken. This one's broken. He's going with the ARP uh, mirrors. This got to get sanded, so this has to come off. And uh, yep, fuck my life. All right, got the uh, license plate out and the light out, so that way when he paints, he doesn't hit the light and it fucks up anything. The light was actually. Cool literally just two clips that you just pull out um god i got so much work to do i better stop talking and get to it that's literally it it's all dense except for that little fucker over there there goes my grandpa driving the truck Seems a little lopsided. Probably because he's in truck. <laughs> um, it drove really good when I when I drove it. Everything seems fine. Doesn't seem like jumpy like it was. It's just hard to drive because it's all uh, ancient. That's why it's lopsided. I forgot to fill up his tires. You see the tire? It's so flat. Oops. <laughs> I was wondering why it was lopsided. I didn't fill up your tires. Huh? <laughs> I was wondering why it was lopsided. I was like, maybe that's because he got in the car. <laughs> you gotta fill in the tires. Yeah, just these two. Yeah, well, check them all. Yeah, that's why I bought you a gauge. Yeah, I know. All right, so Alex is here. We got a new compressor for the shop. Not that loud like this one. And over here, we got Nick, K-Way Garage. What's up? And he is uh, stripping his valve cover because he, because uh, <laughs> it was wrinkled black and he painted red on it because he wanted to make it that type R look. Look, I'm gonna be real. I came down to a conclusion where I said that oh, I had an OEM GSR like black cover, so I was like okay, and it was already wrinkled, so I was like if I just sprayed red paint on it, it'll come out wrinkled red like type R. It fucking came out Compton red, dude. <laughs> 
Do you know you can um, order some off of Amazon DHT? Yeah, but I never took the time to do it. It's yeah, like, I, I want to go back on re uh, black on this. Oh, black? Yeah. VHT, dude. Well, I think it, it's more of a... Alex over here sanding the tons of the We got K-Way over here making templates right. for the ARP uh, mirrors. We got Boss right here just chilling. We got the side skirts off. We got a bumper. We got a sun playing with a jack. We got the mom. We got him afraid of the compressor. Ready. So that we thought this hood was done for because uh, all of this uh, shit right here But we wet sanded it and now look how it came out Pretty smooth pretty good still have some uh, I don't know what you can call these pressure cracks. Is that what you want to call? Them? Good talk Alex mm -hmm. I said what do you want to call these pressure cracks? Anal cracks. Anal cracks? Okay. So we got all these anal cracks and um, still got to keep sanding. All right. We come from the out, the inner, right? Uh, I, I have no space. idea. This is, I literally see the word ER written all over this. So <laughs> <laughs> have fun, dude. Hey, if you get your finger cut off, you didn't get it here. You got it. Is it on? Yeah, it's on. Oh, fuck me, dude. It's slow. It doesn't go quite fast. Not that slow. <laughs> you fucking asshole. Nah. Is that compressing? Press it all the way down. <laughs> That's what I did. Watch. It works. Hey, take your shit off my head, bro. I can't fucking see. You're supposed to tighten it behind your head, you know that, right? Yeah. Sorry. Can I have one of those shell sticks? Oh, Are they cold? No, it's not cold. You now what we're doing is, God damn it, fucking car. Right, what we're doing right now is making uh, carbon fiber plates for his mirrors, and just trimming a little bit and uh, adding, well, trimming a little bit, trying to get it to sit flush. It's up to you though. How do you how do you feel about it? You really scrubs. Plus, it's up to you, dude. All right, so it's all your choice. It's like, so do you want it? Do you want it? Um, what, was, what were the options again? What were the options again? To cut here to go with the flow to the uh, oh, flow yeah, to the go with the flow of the uh, straight. of the uh, of this, or to keep it straight, covering it. Come on, Chris, get this angle right here. Well, I mean, I mean, once you sanded the shape and you ran off the edge, you know. She makes my panties wet. Man. I mean, you're making your own plates instead of uh, spending like 150 bucks. It's all up to you on what you want to do. Go back to the side. <laughs> it's up to you. It's that time again. If you would like to buy anything for your Honda and or Acura, please use the link down below and use code LAZYMAN5 to get your 5% off your entire purchase, whether it be turbo, TN suspension, whatever you need, Neo got you. If you want to buy Activio wear, like a shirt or a hat or stickers, even Walbro fuel pumps, use the link down below. Let them know Lazy Man Garage sent you. If you guys want to buy anything for your motor, whether it's uh, boring out the block or getting head work done, head over to the SB Machine Shop, local in San Bernardino area, also known as the Inland Empire area. My name is Chris from Lazy Man Garage, and I'm lazy, so you don't have to be. Peace.